Welcome to VCHH Playlist. I am your host, V. Make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. But mainly, make sure that you share. Um, I think I have a powerful message. And the name of my message is called Renovation. And it's going to be really short. So I'm just going to um, read this. I posted this earlier today. And it went like this. It says, Sometimes when it looks like things are falling apart, that may be God's way of putting things together. I'm going to say that again. Sometimes when it looks like things are falling apart, that may be God's way of putting things together. Now I want to read this. I want to read a few, uh, something else. What Satan means for evil, God will see for good. Or excuse me, excuse me. God will use for good, excuse me. What Satan meant for evil, God will use for good. And it, it takes me to Genesis 50, 20. Um, I won't even have to read the entire uh, verse, but you intended to harm me, but God intended it for all good. You intended to harm me, but God intended it all for good. So, Often in life, we all got our issues. We all got our personal problems that we're facing. You know, um, rather it's with relationships, um, you know, marriages, um, family issues, um, getting, you know, rather getting along with friends, whatever. Life can hit you with so many different things, okay? Um, and we we're we're not immune to it. Like we all all face it daily. So I thought about what I posted, the you know what I read earlier to begin with, with the sometimes when it looks like things are falling apart, that may be God's way of putting things together. So you think about it. You go look at an old house. You know I live in California, so. Um, you go look at an older house and you're like, man, this mother need a lot of work, you know, but then you see the potential. You're like, you know what? If I do this, if I, if I take all this down to the studs, if I remove this and take this out and open this up. And if I put this here and I put that there and I do this and I put these colors here and I put these, you know, backsplashes here and these tiles here and this wood here and so on and so on. Things you would do with a renovation. Right. And, you know, of course, you know, like. Um, before you started doing that process, there was problems. And sometimes you have to strip down things to the bottom in order to rebuild and oftentimes in relationships it's not that i feel personally it's not sometimes that it's completely broken but that it needs repair it's just like when you go look at a renovated house, you're like, you know what? I really don't want to put the time and the work into it. I just want to get one that's already together. And a lot of people feel like that. Like, I just want, I'd rather just get a house that's already the way I like it. And sometimes people go do that and they spend a lot more. And then they still want to change things anyway. I know, you know, I know that. And so sometimes people look at it on another side and be like, you know what? If I take the time, if I break this all down, this house is actually in a really good neighborhood. I mean, this is like a real valuable area that it's in it's just the house itself but it has so much potential if i just remove this and do that and you know and change this and change that 
and you know build on what is maybe tired or you know distressed you can make something completely beautiful i know that from experience because we did a full renovation um you know on a house that we live in and so i just wanted to hit you guys with that because god has had this on my heart the whole day the whole day and he gave me that message to write the way i wrote it literally you know and it's just been on my heart to do this and finally he told me hey stop playing and just you know put this down and follow it with the scripture and you know and just do what i'm asking you to do do what's been on your heart and so here i am so i just wanted to just hope that touches you guys because everyone's going through something everyone's in some kind of pain everyone's in some kind of you know struggle so i, I hope this uplifts you i hope that it gives you faith to move forward in a positive way so i love you guys pray for me i'm praying for you please leave some comments and um have a really blessed weekend in the name of jesus christ i love you all peace amen